Hey everyone, Technometer here with the video for you guys. Now, if the Amazon app is making your iPhone hot, you want to go follow these steps to quickly fix it. So let's get started. Very first thing is you're going to swipe up and just exit or close out the app and try just relaunching it. So it just reloads the code. You're going to do it again. Now, let's say that didn't work for you. The next thing you want to see is their update out. Usually Amazon and other apps are responsible for the app and they'll make an update as soon as the you report problem. So in the app store, just search up Amazon. So you're going to search up Amazon, for example, and tap on Amazon. And if there's an update available, it's going to say update. You're going to go ahead and update the app. You can see here it's going to download and install the latest update. So if there's any problems with it, it should go ahead and fix it. And you can see the history when the last update were. So as you can see here, it's doing the update here. You can exit out of the app store and see it is installing that update. So we're going to wait for that update to complete and then relaunch the app after that. And then we're gonna open and close it up again. And then check the App Store one more time. We're gonna search up Amazon again, just to make sure if there's another update, you wanna update the app as well. Now, once you update the app, it's time to do this. You're gonna quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appear. So I'll do quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then I hold on to this side button just like that and you're going to wait until the screen goes completely black and the apple logo reappears before you let go of that side button so here just keep on holding down that side button just like that and let go once you see the apple logo now if this doesn't work the very first time you're going to keep on trying it sometimes it takes a few tries to get this right the key thing here is to quickly press and release the volume up and volume down one after another very quickly before holding down that side button. This is known as a force restart, which basically restarts the phone and then reloads the code. Now, after you did this, and let's say you're still having issues with the Amazon app, it's time to just completely delete and reinstall the app. So you can just long press and hold, remove, delete app, and then click on delete. And then you're gonna go back to the app store, search for it and reinstall it again, just to make sure you get a fresh install of the app. Keep in mind your account will not get deleted. This is just deleting the app. So you're gonna go enter your phone password to reinstall and it's gonna go ahead and reinstall the app. Now, after you reinstall it, let's say it's still giving you the issues. We're gonna see the app reinstall. If you don't see it right here, you're gonna go to the very last page under recently added. Now let's say you did all this and it's still not working. There's a couple other things you can do. First thing is in your settings, uh, general and then go to app background app refresh let's say this was turned on in any of these settings for Amazon we need to find Amazon and then turn it off so here as you can see here for me it's still loading so let's go ahead and open it up and then I'm gonna go back here if I see Amazon I'm gonna turn off Amazon and you can also turn off all, all of this if you like I usually recommend turning off that it'll save you tons of battery life just to doing this the other thing you also want to check out in the settings here, in the main settings here, you're going to go down to privacy and security. If you're using location services turned on, you want to make sure Amazon is not using your location services. So let's say if Amazon was using it, it will show up here and you want to turn that to never because when the location service is on by app, it's going to drain and make the phone get hotter because it's consuming battery on your device. So that's all the things you need to do. And the final thing to do is, if you have done all of this, to make sure you update your phone as well in the settings, general, software update, and let's check if there's an update out for your phone. If there is, go ahead and update the phone as well. So that's all you need to do in order to fix it. I hope this video is helpful. So please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.